was watching, washing every car on the lot every day in 1975. Like a Kate has supported this great area. Thank you. 
United Kingdom, Romania, United Arab Emirates, twice in Spain, twice in China, three times in Korea, and many locations, of course, in our good old USA, in Korea, Romania, and China, and the UAE. I was honored to be the only American in my team. At the ball of USSR, after our international pilots had to use what the Soviet and the Eastern Bloc countries could do with this airplane, these airplanes finally became available. They were quick to snap them up because they saw what the Russian pilots could do. They saw the genius of the Russian aeronautical engineers. And they said that in order to be involved, it's not a free ride. Carbon fiber construction cost was no factor. The Russian team spent as many rules as they needed to win the victory. Titanium landing gear, very light but extremely strong, and by the way, very expensive as well. Huey Tolson is unleashing all he's got to the combination of preparation and outcome. And this man took his lessons well. Folks, when he came to Ann Arbor, we saw as he goes into the flat spin about the curly fuse. We saw his nature, his personality, his willingness to learn, his willingness to do anything possible, his enthusiasm, and everybody got on board because this man, he had potential and everybody saw it. By the way, to contrast to the subsidies that the Russian pilots get, and they were given an airplane like this, our pilots in the U.S. are capitalists. They pay for their own planes, they pay for their own training. When they transport those aboard aircraft to world destinations, to represent the United States of America, it is done on their money through fundraising and through some generous sponsorship. Okay, watch. Watch now. They got to hear. Ubi's going to shut the engine off. It is. Then 